KC Illinois is known as a small town with big things, and you're gonna see why. But before we show you all the Guinness World Record holders, let's take you to where we parked our little camper in KC Illinois. If you have a trailer and you come into KC and you decide to spend the night, you have a couple of options. One of them is a KOA, but this option is our favorite. Fairview Park Campground. It's $25 cash. It's owned by the city. Uh, first come, first serve. No one here. You pay somebody across the street the $25 cash. And you even have keys for your personal bathrooms. Can't beat this place. As far as campgrounds go, you can't ask for more than this. Not only is it public campground at 25 bucks a night, first come first serve, 50 amp, 30 amp hookups, water, and there's also a dump station right behind the, uh, the bathrooms over here on the right. You have a fishing lake, you have baseball fields, you have a skateboard park, you have a, a playground, there's barbecue grills, there's pavilions, everything you could ask for at 25 bucks a night is a home run. Bike paths and the town, you could ride your bike. It's less than a mile away, right to all the really cool things to check out right downtown. Let's go see some big stuff. And you can ring it too. These chimes are 54 feet tall and close to 17,000 pounds. This was Casey's first world record holder and entered the Guinness Book of World Records in June 2012. This is a huge teeter-totter. Some of these things are in the Guinness Book of World Record as the world's largest, and some of them are just large. We will uh, attempt to give you the correct information if it's posted. If not, we will research it and let you know. So skateboards, bicycles, scooters, all the all around. Okay, ready? See, I don't know if it works unless there's somebody here to hit that button. Lord. The world's largest teeter-totter is 82 feet long. It entered the record books in September of 2019. The teeter-totter is functional, but only when a okay, volunteer is there to assist on Saturdays during the tourist season. A perfectly balanced teeter-totter will move with the slightest change on either side. Okay. So you don't need 100 people to get this to move because it should be perfectly balanced in the center. So, so maybe it, must it doesn't? Be locked on that end. That's what you saw over there, right? Yeah. And if that was not cool enough, right across the street, it's the world's biggest rocket chair. It weighs 46,200 pounds and took over two years to build. At 56.5 feet tall, it's not just the biggest rocking chair, but also the biggest chair in America. And it was completed in August of 2015, made from recycled wood and pipes. In order to set the record, it had to rock. So it was pushed by several of the local strong men during the certification by Guinness. They say the best time to visit is during the spring and fall because of the gardens. But we were here during the summer and the flowers were spectacular. That's outside of Tina's. The barbershop pole is 14 feet 7 inches tall and 3 feet and 11 inches wide. It was certified as world's largest on September 28th, 2019. Okay, where are we? We are inside the world's largest mailbox in KC, Illinois. If you drop a letter in the slot, the red flag goes up on the outside of the mailbox. Wish we would have known about the red flag while we were here. It would have been a lot of fun for the video. This is a replica of Jim Boland's key to his Chevy Silverado. He's the man behind all the big stuff in Casey. The Twizzle Spoon is 11 feet and 8.5 and inches tall. It was certified in August of 2019. Inside. Let's go inside. How lucky are you that the wooden shoes, the largest wooden shoes, are inside a candy store? The wooden shoes are four feet, nine inches tall and 11 and a half feet long. Each one weighs about 2,500 pounds. The wooden shoes gained the world's largest title on October 20th, 2015. Do not get in the shoes, reads the sign. Perhaps it's to keep visitors away from the money tossed into the shoes and intended to go to the local food bank. So 
this was the largest crochet and knitting needles until 2017? Yep, from 2013 to 2017. Then they were out. Hey, here's the crochet. Oh, there's a certificate inside. Cool. See? Too bad. That's where we're heading next. The Golf Tee is 30.5 feet tall and weighs just under 7,000 pounds. It was certified as the tallest golf tee in the world in February of 2013. You can find it at the KC Country Club. We are at the world's largest pitchfork. Pitchfork. The pitchfork is 60 feet long and just under 2,000 pounds. It's located outside of Richard's Farm Restaurant. It won the title of World's Largest in October of 2015. Pretty much in keeping with all things we've seen so far. Beautiful landscaping. Nicely thought out. They all seem kind of themed, which seems pretty cool. Largest. Very quaint small town. I'm loving it. The man behind the idea of big things small town is Jim Bolin. He's a local business owner. All but two of the items were constructed by him and his crew. Most of the materials used in making the big things are recycled. All the attractions are free and can be seen 24-7, with the exception of the wooden shoes, the knitting needles, and the crochet hook. But they can be seen through the windows when their indoor locations are closed. Here we found some more gigantic stuff. Oh. I got it. World's largest bird cage. World's largest bird brain. Look at the bird. Oh, look at the bird. We're all going inside. Someone's claustrophobic. No, I'm just. Oh, funny. I was going to go in. Lock the door. What kind of bird is this? A dodo bird. You gotta lock the door. Yeah. Allergic. Allergic to what? Prison. Oh no. Gotta hold it closed. Let him out. Let me out, you dirty rat. <laughs> the big pizza slicer and huge antlers were gifts. They were not constructed in Casey. If you're ever driving on I-70 between St. Louis and Indianapolis, make it a point to stop in Casey. And don't be like us and miss the best photo op with a big softball bat right near our campground. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that thumbs up. And remember, when you're out there loving life, you're a hitched up. <laughs>